First, me. Then you. Then me again. Then you two. Then me. One more time. Then everyone else in line. And I'm sure they'll be just fine as long as me gets mine. 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 Capitalism has been acting a bit childish. Unwilling to let go of its me. That security blanket of its youth that's been keeping it from growing into its W. And understanding that me in reverse is M. And M upside down is W. And W on its right side is E. So all this me first mentality needs is to be turned upside down and placed on its right side to see that we is the new me. And capitalism is no longer just growing. It's finally growing up. How valuable a company will be to me depends less on how well they be to see or be to be and more on how well they be to we, the new stars of the show. Mindful and socially responsible customers from moms to millennials will light up the red carpet at every brand premiere. And their response when fashion correspondents ask what we wear will be... I'm just rocking a t-shirt that reads, I changed the world by buying a t-shirt made of conscious consumption that contributed to the relief of 6,000 disaster victims, the full tummies of 17 million hungry kids, and 4 billion liters of clean water, and all I got was this lousy t-shirt. And I'm good with that because I know what I'm wearing looks good because I feel good in what I'm wearing like a CSR superhero in a brand new costume. Please excuse me while I sew this W on my cape because the new Dark Knight is we and a global brand initiative is the new Justice League. Brands of all sizes combining forces and expertise that agree to use their powers for the global good of we to fight for sustainable capitalism, for corporate and consumer activism, for fan action over acquisition, for blind profits, new proactive vision, contributory consumption. A WeCommerce solution that proves the evolution of revolution is contribution, turning every retail transaction into a WeTail brand action, from brick and mortar fashion to mobile apps and virtual rations. Consumers and brands are forming a new social media. And the irony is, technology is actually completing us, teaching us how to be human again, to remember why it is we make money in the first place. It was never supposed to be profit for profit's sake. Corporations are not just responsible for every shareholder, but every stakeholder, every negative externality. This entire world will be our beneficiary or our casualty because the future of giving can only be sustained by the presence of all three pillars of change, where government and philanthropy meet the GBI. So we must remember our ties to everyone that's alive, till we join ourselves to our global social community, till we embrace self-interest, till we purpose profit, and till we define the way we speak capitalism, till we sound like a world of wabbit hunters searching for the wascally wabbits of irresponsible habits and trying to rehabilitate those me-first addicts who cringe at the new vocabulary of we first and foremost us first of all together in the first place we first in the race to first base first impressions of we at first sight for sore eyes must be bigger than my self-interest that doesn't know the first thing about selfish self serving everyone at the table because as long as we are first come we'll always be first served best as an ensemble casting the first stone at apathy that we carry out feet first in line to embrace this opportunity knocking and open the door like ladies first and learn from before like elders first and preserve what's in store for children first right of refusal to follow anything less than people who allow nothing less than progress that creates nothing less than profit that has nothing less than purpose that accepts nothing less than a world of conscious corporations contributory consumers and a come-of-age capitalism that finally puts we first <laughs>